everybody, today I'm going to be doing a station haul for you. I'm going to try and film this video under 10 minutes with the amount of stuff I have, that's highly unlikely, but I'm going to try and do it because I'm not going to spend too much time like faffing around about how I love the product. I'm going to tell you now how obsessed I am with stationery and I'm going to leave it at that. So before going on, I'm going to get started. So I'm going to start off with this pencil case I have in. Oh, I was very surprised when I got this from. It is this like, lovely, lovely fabric. It's stripy, colourful. The camera doesn't do it justice. It's absolutely wonderful. It's really, it's very much big, bigger than it looks. And I found this in W. Smith. It was six ninety nine, and I was quite surprised because it's actually quite a nice pencil case. I was planning on getting one from Paper Chase or somewhere, but they didn't have ones big, any big enough. So I got this one, and inside I just. I brought a, quickly show you, a pack of 12, I think it was 12, yeah, 12 colouring pencils, because no matter how old you are, you need some colouring pencils, and here I have them, I mean, you've got all the basic colours, and you don't need all those fancy ones which have 30 different colours, so yeah, I got those from Paper Chase, and they were £2, and also from Paper Chase, I got a pack of 5, I think it is, I'm going to find the fifth one. Oh, I can't find it. What? I'm sorry, I can't find it. Ah, there we go. Yeah, so I got a pack of five of these. Uh, st stade, stadler, Stadler, whatever you want to call them. It's pencils, nothing special. I think they came with only five pounds. But they've got the different colours on the bottom indicating the different nib sizes. So I got those. Now... Then, then I got Shoopily, I got this. I love these um, thin liner pens that buy Stadler as well because they're so useful for everything and they have like the triangle back so it like, stands up, etc, etc. I got these from Paper Chase for £10.50. I then went to Tesco that evening and I saw they had them for £5.50 five or £5.99 on offer in Tesco. So, and I've... I've also saw the, seen these in Sainsbury's, so go to a, a supermarket like Sainsbury's, Tesco, you know, Asda, they are sure to have these at half the price, so don't buy them full price like a super person like me, so I got those. Then I needed highlighters and I got some really cool ones, um, stab, stab below, like, the, yeah, and sorry about the lighting if it's not great, it is about five in the evening. So, carrying on, another thing with paper chains. Um, I got this 10 subject notebook and the reason why I got this was because it was really big in a good way. It was like really fat and like really nice. I quite like holding big books. And what also I loved because if you can see it has all filed neatly. And so I've labelled, I've like named every um, colour. And what I'm going to hopefully do on this plain page here is do an index. So like... For example, red, I have, put, I have put as biology. Uh, purple, I have put as RS. And like, on every beginning one, I put the subject. Um, like, so whenever I write about a subject, it's going to be in that colour. So it's going to be really organised and colourful. And that was £6, which I think is a really, really good price. So yeah, I got that. Moving on, another stuff from Paper, uh, paper Chains. I got this single thing from Oxford. This was right at the back because they were selling the tins, uh, which were like £6, and I already had the tin but not the stuff inside. So, and this was about 2 99 So I got that from Paper Chains. That was right, I think it was like the last one. So I got that. And then I also got these matte things, which was at the back. A rubber from them, from Matt, this brand that like, just sold Paper Chase. And I got. Um, what if that's called? Uh, ink eraser. And I got two of these because I wanted two because I always lose ink eradicators. The last and final thing for Paper Chains is this really, really cute folder. If you can see. It's my absolute favourite colour of all time. It's kind of like a turquoisey blue. I'm obsessed with blues. Any blue. Like light blue, dark blue, medium blue, cobalt blue, baby blue, sky blue. Anything. And inside this beautiful like, light blue turquoise colour. Absolutely love it. 
just what I needed. It's not long and thin, short and fat, just what I needed. And it's got these cute little balloons on it to add to it. So, and I think that's about four pounds. So, you know, I ended up getting 15% off from Paper Chase because I spent so much. Ooh, whoops. In W. H. Smith, I got a couple of things. Getting while getting, as well as my pencil case. First thing I picked up were these. They are sticky notes that say to do on them. And there's a hundred on them, which is pretty good. And I was going into um Double H Smith to get sticky notes to write on and say what I needed it to do. So I thought I might as well get these because they already lined out and are cuter and pink and pretty. And also they're on offer for one pound and eleven P instead of like two pounds or something. So that's the first thing I got. I then got a really boring thing, a ruler. Um, very, 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 very often I lose my rulers. I use them and I can't even bother to pack them up and I hold them in my hand going to, like, walking around um, boarding school and it falls away and I just, like, borrow other people's or find ones on the floor, take them from the art room. And I finally come into New Year with my own one. This is just a boring, hard ruler. Finally, another boring thing. <laughs> Ink cartridges. They are so expensive. 4 99 for a little packet. That's a ridiculous price. So I got those. It's going to need them. And then I went to Sainsbury's to get some food and I got a backup sharpener and a backup glue stick because I always lose these two things. <laughs> I'm going to show you what I got to, from Tiger. Because I went to Hammersmith, which isn't the most nicest places. But I went there and I went to Primark and I went to Tiki Max and to a, um h and I think, and I brought a whole load of stuff, and including in that, I went to Tiger, and I thought I might as well enjoy that, show you what I got, please leave a comment down below if you want to see the mahusive haul that I did, which actually is quite fun, but yeah, I'm going to quickly, quickly show you what I got from Tiger, so the first thing I got was this little jar, and I was watching Zoella's video, and she got those jars from Tiki Max. And I saw them in there when I went, and ooh, I I wanted one about this size. They only had ones the medium size and the big, big, big size in the heart ones she had. So I decided to get this from Tiger. It's really cute. Open up, and it's like a pink outline, and it was three pounds. And I wanted to keep my nail varnishes in it when I went to morning school. I realised I was stupid because I can fit about four in here because. I use, I have a mahus, mahusive collection of model O nail varnishes. And I was going to keep all my model O, like, um, a couple of models O nail varnishes that I wanted to take to school and put them in here. I realised I can only fit four in here, max. So I might have to get another one. But yeah, that was the first thing I got, and I was only three pounds, so bargain price. I then got some like cute little things. So I love Tiger because there's always stuff in there that you just feel you want to buy. So I then got oh god I can't get it out. <laughs> I got two packs of tissues because you never know when you need tissues and they they always have pattern ones. So I got this one. It's a tissue, a tissue, a tissue, and then an exclamation mark on the other side, and then just some plain ones that had little birdies on them. Then a piece of stationery that actually counts for this haul is this tape dispenser because instead of just having a normal roll of tape get this because it already has the cutter thing and it's so much more easier I then got for like novelty reasons only this really cute little tin which has a heart on it plasters because I thought it was really cute I think I can open it mm, I'm not sure I got this alarm clock in this mint green colour now Sprinkle of Glitter, if you ever watch this, go to Tiger because this is right up your street. Yeah, this was like one, two pounds, two pounds fifty. And it's meant to be an alarm clock. I'm really bad at setting things, like like alarms. So if it doesn't work as an alarm, I just think it'll look really cute, like on my side and on my desk or whatever. Me. It so, it's so cute. Yeah, it's a miniature little alarm clock like that. And I liked it. Then just plain old tag. For your enjoyed this video I certainly did um, if you did like this video give it a thumbs up and make sure you subscribe because I really really appreci appreciate it it means a lot so uh, if you have any comments please leave them in the, in the box below and have a lovely week guys bye